each one of you will be performing this 45 second audition for a solo at nationals. Go through your routines. I want to see 45 seconds of our choreography that you feel is your best work. Now, moms, my staff isn't going to look at them. I'm not going to rehearse them. It's up to you. I don't want to see them prior to the dance concert on Saturday. At the dance concert, I will be executioner, judge, and jury. Just me. Now, Maddie, you are exempt from this audition. You are a shoe-in for nationals. But if a job comes up, I need somebody ready to do their number. Keep your eye on the prize, and that's winning nationals. I have two solos to give out for nationals. I'm looking for number one performers to go to nationals. So it's anyone's game. Which one do you want to do for 45 seconds to show Abby? Okay. It's my job to make sure that Kendall does what she does best so Abby can see that Kendall has earned her spot to have a solo this year at Nationals. But I think applause is more dynamic, and I think it's different from the lyrical that the other kids might be doing. You know, you are like the Maddie on the new team, okay? So show Miss Abby that you are the go-to girl. You've never had a solo at Nationals. Maybe this is your year, so but you... Sometimes Abby just picks her favorite. Nobody deserves this solo any more than you do. This is your opportunity. Go for it. You may have to face many defeats, but you will not be defeated. I'm more determined than ever to show Abby that I'm ready to do a solo at Nationals. I gotta get you out of my system. I gotta get you Mackenzie um, said she wants to do Out of My Mind because it's been her favorite solo that of all cute. times. Oh, that yeah. was good. That was a good one. This is a huge week. Not only does Mackenzie have a solo, like 20 numbers, there's a lot of pressure on her. I just hope she can handle it all. When I discussed it with Mia, she said she was choosing her solo from last week because that was the most successful solo. It had lots of things going for it. She won last week with this dance, so why not this week? Sarah knows that this is her opportunity. At this point, with all that she has been through this season, she's just hoping and holding on. What else can she do? I mean, we get kicked off, then we get invited back. So at this point, we leave it in the Lord's hands. We've agreed on applause because it's a little bit different. And it shows her personality really and it's a lot. Right. This is Kendall's chance to prove she can step right in and take Maddie's place if Maddie can't do a solo at Nationals. Last year, Kendall was second at Nationals. If Maddie doesn't dance, there's an opportunity for Kendall to win first overall. Cameron chose fate, and she said because, you know, she feels that she's ready with that one. Cameron is on the select team, and they've made it clear they don't want us here. But that doesn't really matter, because in the end, we're competing for Abby Lee Miller. How convenient that Cameron gets to come right before Nationals to do her solo. To compete in the 45-second challenge. compete in the 45-second challenge. It's very convenient. I don't really know why Jody and Cameron are here, because Chloe beat Cameron. I guess it worked out, though, because she is hurt. Well, I hope that makes you feel better. Yeah, well, of course, that doesn't make me you know, feel better. I, I feel bad about that. Well, you didn't feel bad when you came in when she was fine. What do you want me to do? You tell I want me. you to do what's right. You should Take have. Take Cameron and go home? That's you, not happening. Whether you like you it or not, You can't change I'm what happened. You Chloe know. beat her hands down. And guess what? I'm still here. You're okay. doing the same thing that one sits there and does. And that's, up. Oh, it's fine as long as my kid comes out on top. That speaks volumes about your character. But your I problem isn't want... with me. Your yeah, problem I... is with us. No, my problem is with you because you think it's OK. Shame on you for way. acting like an idiot right now. You know what? You are filth on the bottom of a shoe. You are filth. I'm still going to be working at the desk, so why don't you guys start doing solos since that's your thing this week? This is your shot. I want to help you guys, but I can't. Maddie, since you're not doing this little activity, why don't you play the music? Play, yeah, Chloe and I have both play music. Abby's focused on the dance concert, so the moms have to get the girls ready for this 45-second challenge. 
You are all vying for a chance to compete at nationals. This is the last chance you get to show Abby you have earned a place. This 45 second solo is really important to me. I've never had a solo at nationals before and it would mean a lot to me if I did. Mia's trying to stay positive. She wants to prove to Abby she is a soloist for nationals. Kendall will have her work cut out for her this week. Abby wants Kendall to step right in if Maddie can't dance at nationals. But you know, this number has a lot of room for error. That can make or break her. Well, rumor has it that Cameron is the favorite on the select team. Everybody's upset about it, but I've decided that I'm just gonna own it. Cameron's the favorite, get over yourselves. Mackenzie has to work harder. Mackenzie has had a solo at nationals ever since we started this elite team. If she doesn't have a solo next week, It'll be heartbreaking. I'm a little nervous for her. Are you guys nervous for 45 seconds? I'm a little nervous because, you know, sometimes Abby doesn't pick, like, the best dancer. She just picks, like, whoever she wants to pick, you know? I'm worried about who Abby's gonna choose because she's making the decision, and there's no other judges, so even if you did the best, she might not even pick you. Everybody ready? You have 45 seconds of a solo. This is it. What happens in the next few minutes could change your life. Let's go. The most important 45 seconds of, of your life. life. Yeah. Of your life. Dance life. Yes. Not life life. Well, you know what I mean. They're rooting for you. Kendall is being looked at as the possible sub for Maddie if Maddie is not going to be at the national competition. She either steps out on the stage and is a better dancer than she's ever been before, or she flubs up and she's just another 11-year-old in Maddie's shadow. Mackenzie has moved up to an older age division now that she's 10 years old. So her chances of getting a solo at nationals are slim to none. She needs to step out on that stage and do something that is mature, something that is flawless. I gotta get you out of my system. I gotta get you off of my mind. But how do I move on when no one compares? They only keep 
I hold Mackenzie to a much higher standard. She was not together. In your face, when I mess up, your face was like a... She knew that she couldn't have any mishaps, but she did. Ow! I'm nervous for this 45-second challenge. Abby has made it clear that she's the judge, the jury, and the executioner. I'm just thankful that Ed Cameron's one of her favorites. Cameron fell out of her turn. I think Mia has a good shot of getting a solo. saw some things I loved. Some of the dancers projected all the way to me. I could see their facial expressions. I could see changes in the emotion. That's gonna be important when they're performing. I want our best shot at winning to be out on that stage. I don't think the moms are gonna like my critiques, but I don't really care. I'm the dance teacher, and I know what it's gonna take to win at nationals. All right, I need to get my hair down, so I will see you after the show. I need to get to the dinner. Please don't come and ask me later about the solos. Don't pressure me tonight. I'm not going to make a hasty decision and just blurt something out in front of the moms. I want to think about this. What did Cameron say? Do you have a lot? Um, Abby sort of has, like, doctor writing to me. I can't always read Abby's writing. I don't know. Use music at end. Did she say anything on your critiques about Cameron blowing her turns? No. Because she's like the Maddie of the select team. Like, she can't see Maddie's sickled feet. She can't see Cameron's mistakes. Cameron did cover it well. No, it was well, bullying. We that's a, that's a trained eye right there. We all saw it. She did cover it well. Saw it. However, no, I, saw I know. I know. Abby sees what she wants to see. Just like when Chloe beat Cameron and she didn't think it should work out that way and she went to the judges, this wasn't cut and dry like she expected it to be. Yep. And now she's backpedaling. The favoritism is crystal clear. Hey! Jody is okay playing along with Abby's fabricated worldview. The kid did not give a flawless performance. But I think as long as Jody's benefiting from the whole experience, it's all okay. And that's not right. Have more confidence throughout. Here, yeah, we can look at them really quickly. Feet and recovery from turn. I'll just be back. Deeper plie, what I always say. Sloppy feet. Reading the critiques from Abby. The chances of her doing a solo at nationals are pretty zero to none. That just makes me sad. I know. It doesn't take away anything that you did last week. I told your mother in the audience, what did I look at you and say? I said, I think I did the best. I did. I know that I don't count, and I know I'm not nationals. That doesn't take anything away from you. Chin up, and you go out there, and you do better than you ever could have imagined, right? <laughs>